hello everyone it's your girl jay nicole back with another video and sorry that my tongue is blue i've been drinking on a blue raspberry slushy from sonic it's pretty good so i just got back home from taking graduation pictures and i still have on one of the um outfits that i wore it just says hotter by one degree hashtag you the bay grad um one of my friends actually made the shirt for me so shout out to my friend charlita for making my graduation shirts they look so good and then um i just wanted to kind of update you guys on what's been going on with me lately so if you remember my very first or second video it might have been my second video because i think my first one was like me introducing my channel my second video on my channel which was back in december i was explaining to you guys um about why i didn't graduate last semester and so i ended up retaking the class that i failed because i only failed one class last semester and that would cause me not to walk so i retook the class this semester by the grace of God, I passed and I graduated. So yes, graduated. Graduated May 9th, 2020, but because of the virus, we are not having the actual graduation ceremony until the end of July as of right now. So they mailed us our diplomas. Yes, ma'am. We actually got our diplomas quick because they i think they mailed on monday and i got mine that following wednesday isn't she pretty yes ma'am if you guys don't know i do have a bachelor of science in psychology with a minor in sociology um they go hand in hand both of them are with the college of liberal arts department at my university and then um just wanted to show you guys my hat my cap with my 2020 tassel my um gown is actually hanging up right now i'm gonna insert pictures i might insert like three or four graduation pictures that i took today at the end of this video but if you're friends with me on snapchat twitter instagram facebook then i already uploaded those pictures but I just wanted to kind of do like a little vlog, just kind of talk to you guys really quickly. Um, what's next now that I graduated? So currently I'm still working at the grocery store that I've been working at for about four years now. I also door dash. I just started door dashing. So once I kind of get the hang of it, hold on, let me... I'm trying to like fix my lighting because I'm using I'm using natural sunlight I also have my light on in my room and I also have a little light that my phone it's like a phone tripod type of thing but I door dash um, I'm still working at the grocery store I've been applying for jobs mainly like the state of alabama jobs because with my degree i can do a variety of different things like social not social work sorry caseworker case manager probation officer i can work with disability special needs people i can also work for like the food stamp office so if you just google what can I do with a psychology degree? A list of things will pop up under the Google search. So I just been applying for jobs. I haven't received a phone call back from any of the jobs I applied at so far. I applied at only four so far. I'm still looking um, pretty much every day for jobs because I want to see what can I do with a four year degree not sure if i want to attend grad school yet just because i just graduated with my um bachelor's and so 
I don't want to just jump into grad school like so soon I want to see like what can I do with a four-year degree so just applying for jobs like I said I'm still working at the grocery store for the time being DoorDash what made me start DoorDash and is this guy came um, through my line and he was just telling me how he been, how he started door dashing back in February and how he makes so much money a week door dashing. And so I was like, okay, let me, you know, let me see. Hold on, y'all. I had a, got to fix my wig. Got to fix my wig. I'm about to take it off when I get done with this video. I was trying to keep it on for the video. And I also, um, you guys probably can't tell, but... I still have my makeup on. I did my own makeup because no one is really, well, I'm not gonna say no one is doing makeup, but I normally go to like Belk to get my makeup done and they're not doing makeup. So I decided to do my own makeup. But anyways, he came through my line and he was just telling me about how he bring home so much money a week door dashing. And I've heard of DoorDash. I've never used it personally to order food, but I've heard of it. So I applied. He told me how to apply. I applied. And a week later, I got a email from them telling me that I needed to do a background. Well, they needed to do a background check on me. So gave them my information to do the background check. They approved it. Um, I passed the background check like a couple of hours after they did it and then they emailed me letting me know that they were seeing me my kit my what well, what comes in the kit is the doordash bag and you also get a car it looks like a debit card the bag is in my car so i don't have it in my room to show you but it's just an orange bag a reddish orange bag it just says doordash on it and so far i like it i haven't doordash since wednesday because thursday when i got off work i don't think i felt like door dashing friday i got off at six and i definitely didn't want to door dash because i only door dash during the broad daylight like now it doesn't get dark until about 7 7 30 but i door dash mainly between the hours of 11 to 1 and then three to like five five thirty three to six is also a pretty good time to door dash just because those hours are consist of they're considered not consist they are considered peak p-e-a-k peak hours which means that's when people are most likely ordering food around those hours because if you think about it 11 to 1 is lunchtime three to like six it's like late lunch or early dinner so people are tending to you know order food and you also get paid extra um during the peak hours so that's the time i normally door dash is around that time because it only makes sense there's no point of door dashing randomly at like when it's not when people are not ordering food because you're going to just be driving around town wasting gas and and you're not going to get any orders so so far i like it i started last sunday so tomorrow will be a week and i've done pretty good for just my first week you know getting the hang of it and it's really easy money easy money easy money the only thing i don't like about it is apartments when people order food and they live in an apartment, Apple Maps takes you to like the wrong apartment um, building. It takes you to the correct apartment complex, but it might take you to the wrong building. And then also having to find the building, find the, the actual apartment number is so confusing. It's a headache. So I deal with it because I want that money, but at the same time, apartments are confusing um but the apartments like the ones that i have done so far where the customer lives in an apartment i really haven't had any problems with except for like two i had to pretty much drive around the whole entire apartment complex before i can find the building but also a good thing about doordash is you can contact 
the customer you can call or text the customer and just in case you can't find you know exactly where they live at then they'll probably just come meet you halfway or you know tell you specifically how to get to their apartment but so far i do like it um i'm just gonna see how long i'm gonna do it don't really know but i just been you know applying for jobs just hoping that somebody someone call me soon because I know that it's still kind of early like I I just graduated some people don't get jobs they don't some people just go months without a job or you know years without a job so I'm just you know applying and reaching out um, putting you know telling other people so maybe other people can help me and I've been on indeed.com I've reached out to other people that I know graduated in my field like years ago just asking them questions and asking for like tips and stuff like that pointers on you know how to get a job where to apply it what to look for stuff like that so and I'm willing to travel like if I have to go outside of the city that I live in I'm willing to do that just nothing like too 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 far but you know like maybe an hour hour and a half two hours tops so yeah i just wanted to kind of just sit down and talk to y'all i should get alexa to play graduation music because your girl made a huge achievement in my life y'all when i tell you last semester just did something to me but i always say this it wasn't my timing god knew what he had in plans for me so me not walking last semester i just had to push that you know brush that on off my shoulders and just re you know just not restart myself but retake the class this semester when i took the class i actually had help reached out had help from a um family friend so i really appreciate her taking the time out to help me because last semester i had no help <laughs> and I had no help. So, yes, I really do appreciate her helping me.